here's the latest on a string of retail thefts in Springfield Township, Delaware County. Investigators say there have been several thefts at the Springfield Mall since mid-November. And in one of those, more than $10,000 worth of merchandise was taken in minutes. Action News reporter Jessica Cartaglia, live at Springfield Township Police Headquarters with the very latest on the investigation. Jessica. Yeah, good evening, Rick. We're talking about 10 in just the past two weeks here in Springfield Township, and police tell me that that number has continued to rise since COVID. This is surveillance footage from inside the Ulta store at Springfield Mall, where police say these two women stole $11,000 worth of products from the cosmetic store on November 17th. Sergeant David Detrolio says brazen shoplifting incidents like this are becoming all too familiar. In the big box stores that we have reports on, it's over 200 retail thefts. In addition to the Ulta theft, police say Macy's next door has been hit 36 times and Target 140. Just four blocks away, another Target store had more than 70 robberies so far this year. I think that it's awful and for people to feel entitled to run in and get things that they don't deserve they didn't work hard for and the rest of us have to suffer as a result. Target has items with security sensors and behind locked cases for what the company calls prone to theft items. Things police say can be easily resold. When they come back, uh, insurance has kicked in, prices may go up, you know, all of those things. And people don't consider that in the moment when they're just reacting. The National Retail Federation says stores have seen a significant jump in financial losses, upward of $100 billion. But police say consumers can help. Certainly in these stores to be vigilant and if they see something happen, uh, try to be the best witness they could possibly be um, and report it to the security. And Rick, in some of these cases, the suspects have been arrested, but police tell me it really depends on the cooperation between these big box retailers working with police directly. Live in Springfield Township tonight, I'm Jessica Cartelia, 6ABC Action News. All right, Jessica, thank you for that report.